Our country is being run by clowns and the most recent clown lasted 44 days. Big Liz Truss has now resigned and her legacy is impressive. She buried the pound, the country, and now the Conservative Party. All in a month. At this point, they may as well just make me Prime Minister. As the man who ratioed Liz Truss when she resigned, ratioed Boris Johnson when he resigned, but most importantly, I never told you guys this, but I even played a part in getting Boris to sack. And I'm gonna tell you exactly what happened. It all started eight months ago, directly at the gates of Downing Street. I'm about to do something the hood won't rate me for. I'm gonna snitch on Boris Johnson because his crimes have gone too far now. I just wanna report something. The man in there, number 10, it's not amusing. It's not a joke. He's committing crimes. Is there any way he can be arrested immediately? He's broken the law. Please do something. Oh, they're meant to be the police. They're meant to care. But honestly, guys, I think they're on his payroll. So we're going to have to do this ourselves. We have a criminal running our country. And as the People's Mayor of London, something has to be done about this. But it's fine because I've already got a plan. I'm going to dig deep and find my inner Jack mate to assemble an army to take outside Downing Street. But I was bringing an army of clowns. Because if we're going to have clowns running our country, we may as well have circus trained ones instead of the amateurs we currently have. We are evicting Boris Johnson from 10 Downing Street. And we have arranged to meet with a group of people who I assure you will be much better than Boris. So um, yeah, let's just meet with them now. Here they are. Serious bunch. Nice to meet you all. Who's the leader here? You, what's your name? Clown Sama, Clown Lord. Oh, okay. All right, that's a great name. If you were to rule the country yes. and a government lockdown were to happen, yes. would you A, stay in your house and follow the government rules, or B, party and break the rules which you made? I would A, I would follow the strict government guidelines yeah. and stay in my house. That's perfect. They're much better than what we've got right now. Come on, great. Much better. I believe in the clowns. And we got more people joining us as well. This really is the circus. Is everyone ready to go? Yes, we are. Well, let's go then. Let's go. Yeah. Come on. Yeah. Let's go. Introducing our circus. Look at all these clowns. They are hell bent on taking over. The circus has come to town and Boris is going to get overthrown by his brother and sister clowns. But there was one more important thing that we needed to do. And right here, we've got Boris's notice of eviction. So let me just sign this here. Oh my God. Let's go. Let's go. You guys are moving in. Oh, it's beautiful. Let's go. The march commenced and the public were in awe at the sight of the circus. Boris Johnson is shaking in his boots. You're not yeah. Get bags, are we? yeah. Hopefully not. Yeah. Hopefully. Hopefully. This was something I was willing to go to jail for, and the clown should be too. My friends, it's there. It's just down there, my friends. We're close now. Hey, let's go. We've almost let's go. reached it. Let's make sure we cross safely. She's not safe. Oh, You're no. not safe. No. Stay no. safe. No. Oh, yeah. follow the rules. Move it like Boris. Wait, 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 wait. We stop it. She's moving again. You're breaking the rules. Boom. Oh, it's green. Yes, it's green. Let's go. Let's cross. We had arrived at the infamous gates of Downing Street, and those police, which I saw before, needed to be informed that it was time for Boris to move out and the clowns to move in. The notice of eviction for Boris Johnson. Right here, we've got the clowns moving in. They'll do a much better job than Boris himself. Okay, so um, they're ready. Let's, uh, let's move the stuff in, guys. Let's go, let's go. The police had been told, and as the removal trucks literally started pulling up, they could only watch the onslaught that was about to occur. Poor police, man. We're evicting uh, Boris Johnson. Um, yeah, yeah, he just needs to go. And right now, we've got the clowns who are ready to move in instead. Obviously, the whole place has been a circus, so um, we feel like we might as well make it official. Our entourage has set up, and we were in formation, and words from my own heart were about to be poured into the ears of the nation. It was time for the message. I'm Nicole Milana, and as the People's Mayor of London, I have a public service announcement. Mr. Boris Johnson, it's time for you to leave 10 Downing Street. You are officially evicted. You and your criminal colleagues have made a joke of this country, so I've decided to replace you with people more serious. Okay? Right here. All right? You have been running the country like a circus, so we might as well make it official. Yeah? So, Mr. Boris Johnson, please leave the country right now. You have until tomorrow, to be completely honest. 
So yeah, it's time to go, Boris. It's time to go. Let's go. These people will do a much better job than you, I promise you that. These words made it to Twitter where the support was electric. Positivity, excitement, and most importantly, memes were shared in support of our cause to remove Mr. Johnson from his throne. The message had been sent, but one man wanted to add his thoughts. Boris, you are now dismissed from Clown Kai. Yeah. Dismissed. Yeah. The clowns hey, don't love you anymore. We don't love the you anymore. Don't we don't love want you. you. Get yeah. out of there. Get no. out. Get out. Get out. We don't rate you anymore. No it's more. time to go. You, no more. Yeah. No more. And the hood don't love you either. The NDL and Clown Summer's madness had been completed. Now, my friends, I guess we just wait here. We're just trying to get a message to Boris, you know because you guys are just sort of out here just not knowing what to do. The impact we had definitely didn't go unnoticed as pretty quickly an officer came out to speak to us. I'm only here on behalf of the clowns, but the clowns are trying to move in. The main guy, Clown Sama Clown Ladin, is basically saying that he wants to move in and if the government is already a circus, that we might as well make it official, you know. That's the only thing. Who are you and where are you from? So I'm just Ray, ratioed. Um, but these guys, they're clowns, and they're from the circus. Obviously, Poor clowns all want to move in, obviously, as yeah. well. He did more than find out, because clearly this man felt the wrath of the clowns and had no choice but to radio Boris to evacuate. Guys, Boris is coming! He's coming! Everyone move to the side! He's coming! He's moving out! Finally! He's actually taking this serious. Bye, Boris! Bye-bye! Get out of here! Ciao! See ya! Adios! There he is! He's in there! He's in the back! Get out! We can move in, guys. Let's go. Oh, no. Oh, they've locked us off. Okay, maybe that wasn't Boris, but more police poured in, but not because of our protest, because our group was growing. Excuse me, my friend. Excuse me, please join us. We're going to move you into Downing Street. I beg you, join us right now. Your brothers and sisters are over here, and they need you to join the movement. Parlo Italiano. Uh, Parlo Italiano, okay. Giuseppe Rossi. Uh, Mario Balotelli. Benucci. So if we just go here, just join us, please. Money. Money? Okay, uh, 20, 20. 20, no? 20. Here come. All right, my friends, we've got another clown to join us. <laughs> He's joined the show. There we go. This one is for Boris. Let's go. No, no threats, no threats. The police are here. The news of our violent riots had spread into the heart of Downing Street because a news team came forth to report on the wildfire. Excuse me, my friend. Excuse me. Are we ready? Sorry, I'm on air now. Oh, you're on air. Yeah, yeah. Hi. Hi, guys. We've got the clowns here as well. Everyone's here. The clowns are not happy. The clowns are getting restless. Don't mess with the hood. Get on with your interview, man. Or else. Social media is one thing, but now we had the opportunity to get our cause global. But as we waited for the broadcast to start, an interesting character showed his face. An op from the EDL. Oh, chubby, chubby. oh, I might as well put this through your heart right now. An op live in the flesh. You get off our streets. It's time to go. For you too. Who do you think you are? All right. Yeah. Now skedaddle. Are you on here on behalf of the EDL? There's no EDL, there's no EDL now. What do you mean? So we destroyed the EDL. You did, you did. Yeah, I did, yeah. I, I, did. I was the man who destroyed no, the EDL. No, you you just told me that the EDL are gone no, and no, no, I'm no, the no, man no, to destroy it. So the EDL that. are you gone. They don't exist. The EDL don't exist because I destroyed them. Did. Yes, I did. <laughs> so you were part of the EDL and no, then I, I made it disappear. I wasn't. I'm sorry, man. I'm sorry that I made the EDL just disappear. All right, well, I'm not a clown, but the clowns are behind me. They are behind you. Yeah. Behind me they were, but there was also a news broadcaster, and I wasn't about to let some rogue EDL member ruin that for me. The message was about to be shared, and I was eager to start. How much longer, sir? I'm Almost about to slice your head off. اهتمت الصحف البريطانية بمصير رئيس الوزراء بوريس جونسون ينضم إلي عمر بشير مراسل الغد من لندن عمر إذا هناك تعديلات يقوم بها جونسون في فريقه ما تفاصيل ذلك حيث نقف هنا في تندورينج ستريت هناك يقف 
بعض الرافضين لاجراءات التي بقامت عديد الحفلات حفلات بمهرجين لذلك هم يرتدون مثل هكذا ملابس ويوصلون رسائل الى رئيس الوزراء البريطاني بوريس جونسون المطالبه بالاستقاله yeah. You have until tomorrow, Boris. I know you're watching right now, and I want you to know that the hope don't break me. He needs to leave right now. Seriously, he has done a terrible job. We are sick of him, and we are here to get him out. We want Boris out. We want him gone. The clowns are going to move in. Is it done? الهدف هو رئيس الوزراء البريطاني بوريس جونسون. I'm gonna let you finish, but Boris Johnson is the worst prime minister of all time. All time. It's time to go, Boris. Boris, leave. Boris, leave. Get out of here. Get out, man. We're not going. Well, we will leave, but just you have until tomorrow. I know you're watching this. Tomorrow at 9 p.m. to get your stuff you. and get out of there. Get out! Get out of there! Make him resign, Omar, please. Tell him to resign. Tell him to resign. Get him gone. That is what we're here for. We are here to tell him. Yeah. Why isn't he listening to us? Everyone, a round of applause for Omar. Thank you. He gave us a voice. We went global and here is Clown Summer with his personal message. Tell him your name. No, your I'll name. do it, I'll do it. Your full government name, tell him. No, no, sure. you must. Now, my name is Clown Summer, Clown Lodge. We are here to get Boris out of here. He has done a terrible job and he needs to be evicted. We are not playing no game, Boris. Boris, out. We want you out. Listen, you have until 9 a.m. Tomorrow. Tomorrow. To get out of there. We want him out. Get out. Boris, out. Get out, man. Get out. Thank you, guys. Honestly, the hood respects you, man. Thank I you I just very want to much. say that. Big up. You may not be moving in today, but we've definitely made an impact. We have made our voice been heard. Respect. I appreciate your help. Thank you. Seriously. Thank you. And I really hope you can move in. Definitely. You are the best person. You're much better than what we have right now. 100%. Thank you, clowns. Thanks a lot. Respect. Thank you, Thank you guys. <laughs> Appreciate it. But I knew Boris was going to be watching the Arabic news interview, and just a few months later, he was clearly scared because he resigned. Gone forever. Until now. Now Liz Truss is gone, Boris may return, and if he does, who knows? I might have to run against that clown.